What's going on guys? Christian here from CK Wraps. Now I'm gonna show you how to tint your tail lights. So today I'm using Vivid Light Smoke Headlight Tail Light Tint. You can use it for either one. Let's start by things that you need. What I'm gonna do right here is mask off the exterior. As far as complexity goes, it varies from, from uh, light to light. These are not the easiest, but not the most difficult. And this comes in two pieces. We're gonna get two lights out of one piece, okay? We do have four, so we're gonna have to cut out two more. We're gonna make sure that we have no tape on our uh, overlap right here. And what you want to do is not get your fingers on the back side where you're going to be applying the vinyl. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna line it up, all right? Start on the flattest part of the light, if you can, if there is a flat part to it. All right, I'm gonna come a little bit lower. There we go, I'm happier there. So, let me squeegee this nice flat area down. That's the easy part. You notice how I kept some of the backing paper on, right? That's just so I don't get a lot of stuff stuck to it. So now what we wanna do is we're gonna take this piece and we're gonna warm it up. We want it to be quite soft, all right? So we're gonna take it, we're gonna pull it outward. So I'm pulling it to the floor and to the ceiling and I'm also pulling it towards the other side of the car. Boom, right there. So this is where it's at. That looks amazing. So we want to get a good tuck right to the edge, for the most part. That should all be good right there. We, don't, we do not need to wrap it around. What we do need to do is make sure that there's no tension on the edge. This is what the tape is for, okay? This is the tape. The tape is so the vinyl can slide off and lift off easily. So let's do up here. So the reason why we have to stretch the vinyl around is so that this part shrinks in and contours itself around. If we don't pull it across enough, what's gonna happen is we're going to, sorry, we're going to end up with a lot of bunched up material in this area, in this area right here, and you're gonna end up stretching it that way. What happens when you stretch it that way, it's going to end up pulling back this way. Right now, the vinyl stretches across here, so we don't actually have any tension on this top edge or this bottom edge. All the tension runs right through here, and we stop it before we get to the very end. That way, we're not stretching all the way through. What I'm gonna do right now is trim out the very edge of it, all right? We're gonna run our blade very gently around the inside edge of the tail light, okay? So I'm gonna come down here, and I'm gonna run it right in between both tail lights right now. You don't have to wrap it around the edge because we're putting a translucent film over a lens, okay? This means that you won't see the actual end of the film. You won't see the line. Can you wrap a little extra around? Sure. Do I need to though? No, because I'm confident that my insulation is, isn't going to fail. Let's get that off. Look at the difference. Go over the edges with heat when we're finished. Always extremely, extremely important. Let's do this guy right here. So I'm gonna cut out a small piece. So this one's gonna be much easier, all right? So I have already wiped these down. 
I do not need to wipe them down again. This one's flat, very flat. But it does have a bit of curve to it, so we do have to curve the vinyl slightly. Now, this one's gonna, really gonna take us probably five minutes. It's the fastest tint you'll ever use, as far as tinting goes. There will never be anything faster, not in my opinion. There are, there might be other air release tints out there, but as far as tinting your lights goes, air release tint is gonna be the fastest by far. So this guy is already tinted. That's all done. So no stretch, right? That means we don't have to do any preheating before we cut. Need to go over the edge with heat. That's that's a mandatory thing. So even if you don't stretch it, you're still gonna go over the edge with heat. These two sides right here, it's pretty obvious what's going on. Uh, you know, this is great as far as accenting the vehicle goes. It's not this tacky kind of red anymore. It's this nice smoked out tail light, and then this one. It's just a regular one. So, oh, wow, look at that. It actually looks identical. It looks no different, maybe slightly on the camera, but in person, I, I barely see anything that's different. Cool, so we have all the lights off right now. How much dimmer does the left side look to the right side? Not much, right? Let's step on the brakes. Now you can tell me, how that looks. I do hope that this video was informative. Thank you for watching. Take care.